Hello and thank you for joining us. We begin with breaking news tonight. A man is dead. Two others are charged after what appears to be a violent road rage incident in the Northeast. CTV News has obtained video of the confrontation. We will not show the moment the victim was struck. This home security camera footage shows the dispute as a red car pulls up and then appears to back up, hitting the man who got out of his pickup. It happened on Temple Drive early this afternoon. Tyson Fedora is at that scene tonight and joins us now. Tyson, we don't know exactly what led up to this, but this is a really troubling incident. Tara, very disturbing incident. We've spoken to neighbors here in this area exactly about what happened here early this afternoon. And I can tell you, uh, traffic has once again been flowing along here for about the last hour and a half or so after police uh, released the scene. And they, of course, are continuing to investigate. But of course, very disturbing after leaving one person dead. All of it captured on CCTV footage and a warning once again, some of these images and, and details may be disturbing. A pickup truck pulls up outside a Temple Drive home, the male driver getting out, and that's when another small red car arrives. That car then reversing into the pickup truck driver behind his vehicle, making impact. He lay motionless. It feels like it's a road rage, seems like. Like, you know, it just happened out of violence yeah. and frust frustration and when life is gone. The video was captured from Mandy Kang's front doorstep. She says she is shocked by what she witnessed after coming home. See, I mean, it's sad. I mean, we just saw, I mean, I've never experienced someone coming home and there's a dead body laying right there. Police were called around 12.30 for reports of a traffic incident involving a dispute with two drivers, but it's unclear where that dispute actually began. I kind of saw the cops from the window from my room, mm -hmm. and there are a lot of cops here. Then, of instance, I saw a car that is, it's got hit and it's got damage, so I thought maybe probably it's an accident, but when I discovered it's a homicide, it's... This resident says he did not see what exactly happened, but says it made him scared for his family. It must makes us more scarier because we are hearing it more frequent now. Kang says she will now take extra precautions when she leaves home. It's very scary being honest here. I mean, like, I would never be able to walk um, my even my dogs the way I used to. Uh, I'll have to be very careful. In the security video, you can see two people come out of that red car. The driver is seen laying a blanket over the victim. Now, police are asking anyone with information or CCTV footage of what exactly led up to the incident that ended here behind me from this afternoon to come forward to police or to Crime Stoppers Terror. Of course, this leaving many here in this neighborhood on edge this evening. Yeah, very upsetting. Tyson, thank you for that.